Hello everyone. In this video, I will discuss something very common. However, it is only term which is common and its explanations is pretty interesting that is the difference between constitutional law and administrative law. In fact, constitutional law and administrative law both sound alike and many times, they appear that they are overlapping, as both are public law and both are concerned with the functions of government. However, they are, at many places, distinct from each other. In Jennings' word, constitutional law deals with the general principles relating to the organization and powers of the various organs of the state and their mutual relationship of these organs with the individuals, whereas, administrative law deals with the organization, functions, powers and duties of administrative authorities. The following table illustrates the major differences between constitutional law and administrative law. Constitutional law is the supreme law of the country. Whereas, administrative law is subordinate to the constitutional law. Secondly, constitutional law is regarded as the genus from where other laws originates. Whereas, administrative law is species of constitutional law. Thirdly, constitutional law largely deals with the structure and different organs of the state. Whereas, administrative law deals with the various functions of the state its administrative bodies. Fourthly, constitutional law facilities all the branches of law and gives guidelines with regard to the general principle relating to organization and powers of organs of the state, and their relations between citizens and towards the state. Whereas, administrative law deals with powers and functions of the administrative authorities, such as public departments, local authorities, and other such statutory bodies. Fifthly, constitutional law also gives guidelines about the intentional relations, whereas, administrative related administrative authorities. Sixthly, constitutional law imposes certain negative duties on administrators, especially when they court violating the fundamental rights of the citizens. At the same time, it also imposes certain positive duties on administrators, for example implementation of social welfare schemes, etc. Whereas, administrative describes only functions and duties of administrators. Last but not the least, the constitutional law has complete authority over the administrative law and administrators of the country. So, the administrators are always or believed to perform their functions with utmost obedience to the constitutional law. This is all for this video, hope you must enjoyed the simple explanations and differences between administrative law and constitutional law. See you in next video.